as you know, we are in the midst of uh, a, a strategic plan. Uh, that strategic plan is ambitious, it is robust, it is comprehensive, but most importantly, it is community inspired. And so while we have made significant progress towards the implementation of key components of that strategic plan, we felt that it was really important for members of our legislative delegation and special guests to make sure that you see some of the work that's actually manifesting in classrooms and producing really positive and strong outcomes for our young people. Who are our main We have historically been the setting where every industry comes and tells public education, we need more engineers, we need more scientists, we need more manufacturing and logistics technicians. Well guess what we need more for communities to thrive? Public service. So um, in partnership with Southern Crescent Technical College and Mercer University, we've launched a uh, complete redesign of the teacher preparation and pipeline pathway. While in high school, you can have 30 dual enrollment credit hours, paid work-based learning placement junior and senior year of high school, graduate with a high school diploma in hand, the equivalent of an associate's degree, and become an apprentice teacher that next year in a Henry County classroom with a one-to-one -one supervising teacher. So that is um, one of two, which we are projecting three of these um, uh, innovation camp innovative campus uh, pathways. The second was just launched like last week or two weeks ago and this is a partnership with Henry County Schools, Piedmont Henry and Gordon State College. We are taking the current healthcare pathway. We actually enhance that with 60 dual enrollment credit hours. It allows a student to graduate with a high school diploma. It allows them to graduate with an associate's degree and they have immediate admissions into Georgia State, I'm sorry, Gordon State College for their BSN program or a contract in hand to work at Piedmont Henry. And this would include paid work-based learning your junior and senior year as well. I could probably talk all day and look forward to talking all legislative season on just how much more we can do to ensure that communities are thriving since school systems are the backbone of making that possible.